Okay, we finally had some break in the weather here in Southwest Florida. It's pretty much rained almost every day since April, which has put a hold on some of the faux finish and murals that go on on the outside. But today we have beautiful sunshine and no rain and no rain expected for tomorrow. So I get to do go back to an exterior project where there was some faux finishing done that was done in a peach crackle. The client has a mailbox that is actually a dolphin statue, a very popular motif down here in Southwest Florida because we have some delightful bottled nose dolphins out in our waters. And this one, however, she had requested it to be painted peach, which at first we thought, hmm, a little unusual, but I did some research. And there actually are naturally colored, blush colored dolphins out in nature. There's one in China known as the white dolphin. There's one in Brazil known as the pink dolphin. And then you may have seen a photo of a little bottled nose um, dolphin swimming along with a friend of his that looked very pink. And that's because that dolphin had albinism. So this little guy today is going to be painted a blush color to go with the exterior of the house. I will give some still shots step by step. I would take the camera outside, but although it's not raining, there's a lot of wind today, so the sound would be a little hard. Um, the first step you're going to want to do when you do a statue, particularly on the outside, is make sure that there isn't any mold or mildew, uh, grunge, dirt, things like that. Maybe wash him off, make sure you let him dry. You can also wipe him down with a little bit of denatured alcohol. Then you're going to put a primer on, like uh, Kills. Um, kind of get him all prepped up and ready and seal off anything that might be lurking. And speaking of lurking, when I do work with statues on the outside, you do want to pay attention to your environment. We have some interesting insects and little critters that can live around our statues. So you want to want to clear those out first. And then you're going to paint him with exterior paints. And then we're going to seal him with a C500 urethane in a satin finish. And uh, anyway, I will give you uh, still photos step by step, and you can see our little peach colored dolphin. But I will walk you through the steps with pictures piece by piece. I guess I should take off my hmm, glasses. I might have to do this all over again. Well, oh, crappy